<laughs> it's such an unorganized fucking interview. If you clicked off, yeah, if you're still with me, real shit, thank son. you. Yeah, I got real shit. Um, sorry. Real shit. SweeneyKovar.wordpress.com. Fantastic blog. Uh, great interviews. He has these uh, uh, CD CD radio mixes. I think you just did your ninth one, right? Yeah, I'm just I'm just doing them because like I I'm just turned into the mix master over here. Because uh, I just did it because I didn't have time to post shit because I've been really busy doing like real life shit. This what's past funny? It's fu- it's funny how people like hit you up like. You're lagging on content, like I'm like, no, I'm not, motherfucker. Like, yeah, like how do you know? Life, go, go. Like, no, but like, how do you? What do you? I'm not like. That's what I hate. That's one of the things about blogs that I really, really hate. That has made shit so like disposable and shit. Like, all right, you gave me like 30 songs today. Tomorrow I need 60. Like, fucking chill. Like, I already, I've all been right, giving dude. you shit like every every week for the past like month. We got like an hour's worth of music. Like. So so right, listen have to it. Become, shit. Have you become a slave to the blog in some way? Sometimes? No, no, because I don't let it. But like, you, you people, think people, people do. People like people have that kind of like. Nah, like I. The reason why I still like doing, I still do, is because I like I do it in a way that like I enjoy. Like half of it is for me as much as for other people. That's why I can understand it not being all up and getting blasted out like some of the other people that you know actually make money off of it. Right. Like, part of it is for me to be able to look back like five years from now. And, be able to remember exactly what I was listening to like a different time. Right. You know? So what uh, help out n- n- another blog, um, as much as shoes doesn't like them, but uh fuck it. <laughs> Okplayer.com. We got some good shit. No. No, but, but see people no. have to make the di- make a This is this is what it's like. It's like, though. it's like going to McDonald's and getting the fucking walnut and apple pack. Like that shit is good. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like but there's a whole bunch bunch of other bullshit that's bad. You know what I mean? Yeah. I, I don't need you to tell me why you think Michael Jackson is not official because he Fuck here, man. he plays basketball left-handed. I don't give a shit. Like, give me some new shit. You know what I mean? I found out about John through OK Player. Like, that was a good thing. You know what I mean? I found out about shoes yeah. through OK Player. Like, yeah. there's a good in there. It's a bad. Tell you some real shit, okay? One of the most important things I was ever taught in my life was in my fucking junior year of high school in political science class. And the teacher taught me, he said, you have to always be source critical. Yes. You have to be aware of the source of your information. Yes. And on some real shit, 90% of the motherfuckers posting on that bitch is completely pointless. They don't even, I mean, you know what I'm saying? If you don't exist in the real world, I'm not trying to list you, listen to you on the phone. I have to say, as an educator house, that makes me feel good that you took something <laughs> away from school. Real <laughs> shit. I took one thing, and it was that. Right. But just as a, as, as a quick thing, okay, play thing, like people talk a lot of shit about okay, play, which is definitely worth it, but people do got it. Realize that the people that run the site are completely kind of separate from the people right. that post. Yeah, on the yeah. Board. It's like a, Dan and a lot of them. Are the like, shit that really opened my eyes dude. is like I know, like I know some of these cats. Like I know some of these cats, man. Like no name. when I was work, I, I'm working in shops and I'm seeing like scrub motherfuckers come through. Like I'm not no. I'm hum- It's humble. Ar- <laughs> it's humble arrogance, man. I know that I'm the shit. Like real talk. I'm not going to scream it to you. I know it. I don't need to make you believe in it. You know what I'm saying? The intelligent ones understand. The dumb motherfuckers fall by the wayside. You know what I'm saying? And, like, if you would see the type of individuals in the real world that are fucking 100-plus <laughs> post replies on OK Player and shit like that, man, these motherfuckers don't even exist in the real world, man. Mm-hmm. So, I mean, God bless you for being able to find a space in a situation that really actually doesn't even exist. But nah, man, I, I'm, I'm old school, man. If you can't say shit to me, to my face, you gotta type that on a keyboard, then your shit is even not, not even worth being responded to, yo. I'll put, I'll put it to you like this, and this is a point I made on air, but if someone hasn't caught the show, I'll put it to you in the video. I think nowadays in this music environment, it's become like doo-wop, you know what I mean? Back then, you would sing for your mom and pops and your little sister, and they'd be like, oh, you sound good. Then you go downstairs and you sing on your stoop. You know what I mean? You sing for your boys and like, yo, son, you're pretty good. Then you sing at the at, at the feast or at the block party. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? Then you sing for your city. And it's like that. And I think anything other than that organic, hand-to-hand kind of right. journey like that, like that. Yeah, you are good. Go tell that guy. You know what I mean? That's the real shit. Like, yeah, like all them greater than, less than posts and shit no, like no, that. No, no, yeah, no. Like, who do you think like, is what better? Type, what type what of time do you have in your or, day? Like, what, the, the, to the just point, put up some pointless ass shit that motherfuckers going to waste their life the, away the point, the, point I'm, the point I'm getting at is this. Is that I, I think in general, it's too easy to judge things comparatively. You feel me? Like, I don't need to know, like, yo, shoes and shit is good compared to my little sister who has a Casio $70 keyboard. Like, no. Like, in the absolute sense... 
does this music touch me? Yes, good, fuck it. Ooh. I like it. Then I'm going to go tell somebody about it. You know what I mean? Like, And I, I'm a victim of it too. You know what I mean? Like, I... I I see myself getting fucking confused. Like, our camera woman will tell you, like, the last Common album. I was like, oh, this shit is whack. And I hadn't even fucking heard it. You know what I mean? I heard it, and it is whack. But, but. but we still but, love you, Common. No, Common, like, we still love you. you, you come back. Not, all of, Not all of it is whack. Not all of it is whack. What, what a world Not is a dope all of it song. Is whack. Universal mind control come is back. dope. You know what I mean? Like, it is not. Yeah, but as much music we've even accumulated at this point in our lives, mm-hmm. are we really going to pick that shit up again? Mm-hmm. I hope you get your money. Kudos to you, you know what I'm right. saying? This is I the one thing I've learned through music mm-hmm. is and I, it's kind of funny cuz it's more with people that you personally might know is that you learn to respect the point in their life that they're at and what they're trying to do. So I respect you for that. I might not be listening to it, yeah. but that's what you're trying to do. More power to you. There but it me, is. I'm not fucking with. And he I'll loves what he does. And like water for there it is. So the cl- goes back to we'll, we'll close on this point right here is, is that I think, you know, <laughs> Like what you like. And I was going to put, I'm going to put a post on this on the website. Sandwich. <coughs> KPFK, sorry, I cough. I'm just so sick with it. Uh, uh, <laughs> my attention. Um, good timing. Wow. No, good but time. like what you like, man. If you, if you like something and it touches you in the soul, I'll be, I'll be completely fucking honest. When I first heard the Yancey Boys album and I heard Timeless, and I started thinking about my homeboy that died like six, seven months ago. You know what I mean? And I started fucking crying. You know what I mean? But that's that's real. Like, I felt mm-hmm. that shit, and it touched me, you know what I mean? And that was a connection I made with the music. Mm-hmm. And you connect with the music. Food, you eat that. You don't go ask somebody, like, yo, son, what do you think of these empanadas? Like, no. Nah, if it tastes good, it fucking tastes good. <laughs> right. And that's it. So all the blogs and all that shit, even what I'm doing, fuck my opinion. If you like something, be a champion of it, and tell those that you care about, give it to them, pass it on. Because mm-hmm. that's the only way that brothers like this man right here, house shoes, and you can pan the camera over there, my man Illa J., that's the only way they're going to keep making music is right. if, and bring it back to center, <laughs> is if you like what they're doing, go out, be an advocate, be a champion. Fuck if anyone tells you you're a fanboy or a stan. Champion good music because that's the only way it's going to continue in this blog world. And also on that note, to add that, also have try to have good taste. Like Don't just <laughs> like something because it's not on the radio. Right. Like Shit. a lot of... Like so uh, No, that's not fair because what if they do No no no, 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 no I got a point I got a point I got a point on this. I got a point on this. I got a point on this. Listen, I'm not I'm never gonna anything. The obscurity thing. I got something you ain't got. All it is is one upmanship. That's what the whole shit turned into. I got something you ain't got. What he's talking about is even post about music if they don't think that it's some shit that somebody else ain't heard. And I don't give a fuck. I got a podcast and I try to break new music, but fuck that. I'm about to start just going back and playing shit that I like. Like, and if you got something to say about it because it's been out for 10, 15 years and someone else posted on their blog last week, man, fuck you, man. I'm house shoes and I play the shit, so pay attention. You know what I'm saying? Like, what I've seen a lot... Sorry we're running long. It's going to be like, three parts, but cool. we need to have this conversation. Whatever, but, like, what I've, what I've seen a lot is that since, like, uh, the way that labels have run shit has become so stagnant, like, any new motherfucker that comes in, it's like, oh, he's, like, different. It must be kind of tight. It's like, okay, he's different. I respect people for doing what they do. I'm not saying people should stop trying their art form. But the thing is, like, people were, like, crowning mediocre people as, like, having, like, that shit when there's Yo. people that, like, when, like, John just released an Yo. album that's rapping over Dilla Beats. And, like, like, like you were talking about, honestly, when you first heard it, like, I think that you... Your shit's gonna get like yo. so much better. Yo, and that shit's yo, still yo. in yo, 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 like, yo. better than all. Not to cut you off.